And I just received this from that same subscriber that I was talking about in the last video that I posted about Oroville. Well, she was right. PG&E begins forewarned power shutoffs. This is updated at 610 your time in California. PG&E will have a resource center open in Oroville on Sunday from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. The center will have water, air conditioning, charging stations, and customer care staff. It is at Harrison Stadium, Oroville, at 1674 3rd Avenue. Aren't you lucky? Aren't you lucky that PG&E is providing a place where you can all congregate, get to know one another, uh, get some air conditioning, charge up your phones, get customer care should you need it, and you'll have water there. Shut off power for 27,000 customers late Saturday night. Isn't this great? The company is warning Butte, Yuba, Nevada, El Dorado, and Placer um, counties that the shutoff will begin at 9 p.m. tonight following early morning shutoffs in neighboring counties. So, 9 p.m., it's 10.43 p.m. on the East Coast, which means that it is, is it quarter of eight there? Am I right on the math? Well, I'm sure you guys that your brain is still working better than mine will figure out the time. Oh, geez, you can look at your computer and know what time it is there. Okay. The outages are expected to impact approximately 1,600 customers across Napa, Solano, and Yola counties. But that's not the 27,000 that will be cut off at 9 p.m. tonight. Okay, Butte County, portions of Paradise, Oroville, Bangor, Forest Ranch, Chico, Berry Creek, and Palermo. Yuba County, portions of Browns Valley, Oregon House, Marysville, uh, Wheatland, Rackerby, Nevada County, Grass Valley, Smartville, Rough and Ready, Penn Valley, El Dorado County, portions of Pilot Hill, Greenwood, Georgetown, and Cool, and Placer County, portions of Auburn and Lincoln. And you can click here for the map of the shutoff area. Aren't you lucky, guys? I would be so pissed. I'm sure a lot of you are. And Oroville, wow. Shutting off electricity in Oroville. Considering what's happening with that dam, I sure wouldn't want my electricity shut off. I'd want to be very close to any alert that I might be getting. Oh, you can still get them on your phones, right? You still have Wi-Fi, right? Unbelievable. 